si es que nunca te vuelvo a ver Pues que te vaya bien ¿Qué vas a hacer? Cuando te enteres que te anduve buscando y nunca te encontré ¿Qué voy a hacer? El día en que te vea feliz con alguien más y en mí ya no pienses And you guys tell me a color All right, guys, so right now I'm editing the, the last video you better watch. Well, the one you last watch right now. Right now we on the freeway at the baby country right now. Start of the vlog. Uh, welcome to the De La Bueno channel as always. Thank you for watching everything. Uh, today we do drop out the truck to get tuned and we'll be picking it up. Uh, we're on the way to LSX Experts and well, let's check it out. Let's go see right now we're about 45 minutes away. I would say, Romano. Yeah, and we're swapping the steelies on it. So you guys are gonna see that part. I'll show you once we pull up. Sheesh. We pulling up right now, guys. To LSX Experts. Got some little badass whips out there. I guess just park right there for I can't load it down over here now. Huh? Pues donde sea donde, wherever it's like less steep, let's say like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pero para que baje la trailer, pero me digo. All right, guys. So I just walked in and checked up with the guy. He said he's ready for my truck. So I'm going to just unload it right now. Then we'll swap out the Steelys. He told me to just park it in the front, I guess, or somewhere around there. They have hella Corvettes out here. They have a Z06. That bitch is bad. And we'll see what's up right now. Load this truck real quick and let's see it start. I'm gonna turn it on right now. Y'all guys can get a little start up. And we'll see what's up. Sheesh. Turn this bitch on. But they had a badass Corvette that had turned on, but that shit was like all camped out and shit. God damn, that shit was frozen. Yeah, supposedly today's supposed to be like the coldest week in Georgia. It's like 25 degrees out here. So let's see. Let's turn this bitch on real quick. Yo, should I turn it on? Let it heat up, no? Yeah, uh, little cold star. But yeah, guys, we're gonna load it real quick and I'll show y'all when it's already in the ground. Don't join on my wood. It's getting fixed today. We got the wood last night. <laughs> but yeah, all this shit is frozen, man. It's all, that shit was all water in the morning. It had like all water and stuff. Yep. So load this bitch real quick. This is how we're looking like right now after the truck is unloaded. We are gonna take off the billet just for I could get the other one um, repaired and we'll get all of them polished up. So I'm gonna leave it on Steely's here. But yeah, this truck was a. It's amazing, bro. I love it. <laughs> but yeah, I left the sunroof a little open right now just so the lens I could get some some air. Either way, the heater and everything works in this bitch. So I was. I'm loading that bitch, I was warming up, but goddamn, it's like 25 degrees out here. Shit, everything is freezing. Look at this, it's tortillas, my boy. <laughs> Wait, we're fixing to swap them over. I'll show you after the studio's are on.
leave it here for a week and we'll see what's up, what they tell me. I'm gonna go drop out the keys and pues, so now, I'll see you next week. Several days later. All right, what's up with you guys? I wanted to give you guys a little update. Um, today is Wednesday. I haven't gotten a call for the baby country to get um, picked up from the tune shop. It is a LSX performance right now, LSX experts, I mean. And well, um, we're just waiting on that call. But as of right now, I wanted to show you guys something else I'm working on. We got another project. Uh, I don't really like post much of these projects that we work on on the YouTube, but this was pretty exciting. So I'll show you guys a little clip of what we're doing. All right, so this is a Cadillac Escalade 2010. Has a 6.2 with the 80 trans uh, rear wheel drive. And we're planning on swapping everything, the front end, interior dash, the whole front end and everything to this single cab. This single cab is a 2012. And NBS, and we had already started doing the swap a couple years back. Got a Cadillac door right there. This is the original 6.2 that was in there, but we didn't really have everything to swap it in there, like as the fuse box and the whole rest of the wiring for the um, the interior for it to all work because we want the dash and everything to work in one of these. So we opted to just get a donor. We got this donor for dummy cheap with everything working. The motor is nothing but good. No check engine lights or nothing. So we're gonna we're fixing to swap everything from this one to this one and build like a little Escalade clone. But yeah, that's a little project we had a couple years. We're, we're fixing to bring it back to life. And well, yeah, this truck wasn't an accident, so it's perfect for a donor. After this, we're fixing to scrap it and everything. But yeah, so on 22s, this one's still like on 17s. So we're fixing to swap everything. As you can see, still got the doors. And well, that's mostly everything. Well, yeah, swap her over, swap her over. That bitch is on. Little project we've been working on since the baby country's been at the tuner. Like a week and a half? A week and a half, we got it all swapped over from the donor truck that's over there. And oh well, yeah. Turned off. That went Brian excited, yeah, boy. Yeah. Half of the interior in there. We still put in the sound system I had in there. We're gonna put in the seats. But hell yeah. Which look good, huh? Hell yeah. <laughs> look at look good, look at Yeah, right? Hell yeah. Fuck yeah. <laughs> Alright, what's up guys? So today is, I believe it's Wednesday. I don't know what day it exactly is. But we're in February now. Thursday. It's Thursday? Yeah. What day is it then? Thursday. What number? Alright, today is February 8th guys. I got my parents with me. They're giving me, well, I'm driving over there. But we're heading to go pick up the baby country finally. And well, yeah, I'm more than excited to go see the truck and actually drive it back. I was able to get the sticker done, you know what I'm saying, out here with the plug in. We plugged in out here. And well, this is the main weight. This is the main thing why I haven't been posting videos. I did want to post another video because I do have a daily getting tuned, but uh, I didn't want to fuck up the series that I got going on. I love these baby country videos. I love putting them out there for you guys to just see on what exactly is getting done. But uh, with the tuner taking three weeks, man, I did get delayed on everything I had to do to it. So I don't really know if we're going to be even able to get the body work done or anything like that. But I am planning on getting bigger tires for the, the wheels because they did tell me I needed bigger tires. So that's why I keep keep repairing that wheel. And well, like I want to stop repairing that wheel. But if it goes bad again, I'll just buy a whole replacement wheel. It doesn't matter. But luckily, we got those fixed. And well, yeah, right now we're heading to LSX Performance, LSX Experts. You get that chipped up. Well, yeah, out here, Marietta. Uh, yeah, let's hit it over. Matter way, gotta keep it going. Keep going. Hearts going broke, it's showing. Broke. Youngers on the block, they toting. We check the tables on the block, they patrolling. For the cloud chase, turn to an up pack. Be the one stop me, you're not that. No. Put a face on T, ain't did it. Ain't no 16, no spread back. Ain't never had a jug off the dirt bag. Had them cheap ass, we call them the boot packs. Ain't never been down in the hole. Late night, I was stuck in the car. I was thugging all on my own. So yeah guys, we just picked up the truck right now, fixing to drive it back to my area. But yeah man, shout out to the guys at LSX Performance, they came through. And those are a little bit long, hopefully the truck drives way better with the good tune. And well yeah, they got some badass cars, they got a V, Camaro, Corvette, they got a lot of stuff back there. And well yeah, let me, let me do it with a little cold start real quick. 
See how it's chopping and stuff. Let's see what's up. Guys, we're driving back to the area and let's see how the drivability is doing. Fuck, I'm excited. <laughs> Jeez. Well, yeah, just taking it out the shop, like literally a couple miles down, this truck is actually driving way better. It doesn't die on me no more, nothing. The tune is it's pretty much driving way better, you know what I'm saying? The truck is bouncy. I do not remember how coilovers felt. <laughs> well, yeah, that's that's a little bit, that's the only thing I gotta say. But once getting used to the coilovers riding again, man. This truck is gonna be perfect. Like literally, it shifts on point. Literally all good. I just need to fill up some gas. And was yeah, all the way back to Gco. It's a good hour, hour and 20 minute drive. So it really put the truck to the test and the whole tune. But yeah, checking it out, man. This truck is actually driving good. I love it. <laughs> but yeah, the sunroof is open, even though it's fucking cold as hell. But man, I love it, man. I, I, I miss the feeling of this. You know what I'm saying with the sunroof truck with a nice interior single cab especially a single cab ever since i got rid of my lining i haven't really been driving a single cab like that but yeah guys fucking i'm happy as hell and let's let's head over to the gas station the racetrack which is up the streets go fill up and pues, yeah we'll head back to back to the area all right guys so like right now man i'm honestly so excited excuse the little rubbing i think it might be the drive shaft i don't know it's when i switch these wheels it always goes lower and everything so i think it probably be, is that we'll get that checked out later but yeah guys as you can see I'm driving the truck. It's a whole different. It's a whole different feeling being here. Honestly, I haven't been here here about a good nine months now, and well, it feels so different. I'm more than excited to actually fucking drive the truck and everything, man. I miss this truck so much. And well, yeah, I don't know if you can hear it in my voice. Like I'm literally like I'm shaking, man. Like this shit. <laughs> this is like one of the best days of my life, man. So just to, uh, just to give you a little explanation overview, if you guys haven't seen the video, the last video, but I did go with a new Texas Speed Cam. We did uh, do the Cal Caltech, Caltech or whatever, uh, oil pump. We did do a 160 thermostat. We did a couple other things as well. Of course, it has the full exhaust, the, the shorty intake and stuff like that. So that's the mods we got going on with it right now. That's what I got tuned with. And right now it's driving way better than how it did back, back when I got the work done, like the first cam, the GPI cam. And well, man, honestly, I'll give a big shout out to LSX, uh, LSX experts for getting me right, man. If you guys need any tuning or anything, uh, definitely hit them up. They're probably like one of the best here in Georgia because I've, I've dealt with a couple tuners and man, a couple people, they, they all bullshit you. They're all copy and paste guys and everything, man. These guys, they honestly took the time. I can see it. Like you can notice, I can notice the difference because I, I would daily drive the other truck. Well, this truck with the other tune. And you can honestly notice, notice the difference. It drives way better. The drivability on this bitch is actually A1. Like I, I could probably drive this truck to right now to Cali type stuff. Like it feeling way better. And well, yeah, uh, I'll show y'all like how the exterior is looking as of right now. I will show you a little bit of the things that I do want to fix because I won't be able, I won't be able to take the truck to be honest to the painter. So I'm gonna just get like the little plastic things I don't like and like the rear bumper, the little lip thing that I don't like. I need to get it all fixed. And well, yeah, the crunch time is here. Today is the eighth, I believe, like I mentioned earlier. Uh, we left, we leave to LST the 21st. Let's see it, so let's, let's head back to the road. I said like a thousand, uh, uh, I'll head back the road. We'll head back to the area, like I said, a thousand times already, but I don't know, I just I just can't get this excitement out, man. I'm literally excited as fuck that I'm driving the baby coach. He's like, happy as hell. But yeah, guys, I'll catch you with y'all in a little bit. What's up, guys? Uh, excuse the little transition and stuff like that. It was, went to go drop out the truck at the house. Excuse the background noise. Went to go drop out the baby country at the house. But to keep it in the mood of the getting the trucks tuned and stuff like that, I have my daily. I came to drop out get tuned. It had a little problem with the harness, but I already got a harness at the crib, so we're gonna get get swapping that. But right now, I'm gonna take you guys to go pick it up. It's up here by Chaparro over here in Gainesville. So I'll just show y'all. You know, we're gonna what's it called? Kill two birds with one stone. You know what I'm saying? Pick up the other one and pick up the other one. We pick up one and pick up the other one from tuning. So let's do it, guys. 
It's all about tuning today, literally. Got the trailer now with the Denali. Got that boy Mondo with me. And we're uh, pumping up some diesel. Yeah, he's ordering more parts. He got so many bills, you don't even know what the fuck he's ordering. But yeah, guys, how we looking right now? Catch out when we pick up the truck. So there's a the little truck. You get the chop. Just gonna get the harness issue fixed up with it. It's just a little bit of something, something. We'll get it. We'll get it good, we'll get it good. Ugh. I'll do this to the bitch over here. Uh. All right, guys. So as you can see, the truck is already up on the trailer. Just a little rundown over this truck. It was a bubble eye, so I did a cat eye HD front end on it. I believe the uh, the pad is a little bigger on the HD, but everything is there. I got the fog lights. Uh, this truck has a 6.0 uh, LQ4 uh, cam stall diff. All that is all gone through. It has an 80 trans. Um, the only thing I'm missing is heads and. A manifold just say it like that but it has everything else on that injectors fuel pump i just needed a retune because uh this truck um i had just threw the fuel pump and the bigger injectors in there so that's what we brought over here but he told me honestly to just get the harness issue refixed really like fix it up throw a new harness something like that like a lq4 harness for it can actually read all the sensors and everything we need but yeah just a little overview of the truck i haven't really posted much about it because it's supposed to be my daily it's supposed to be my little work truck it's on a little four six drop uh, the interior don't really got nothing. I'm fixing to do the electric swap. It has the the doors already there, and these are the tail lights. Got some clear cat eye tail lights. Yeah, look, look, it's a clean truck. But yeah, we'll fix on doing the SS clone on this one, which that's my end goal. But for now, it'll be a good work truck. But yeah, I'm gonna get this harness swapped and we bring it back to get retuned, refinalized or whatever. But as of now, it stays on and everything. And we, yeah, feeling this on strapping her down. As you can see, like Chaparro's Chop Shop is over there. That's where I got the baby country done. And these boys are right here. It's the same people. So we'll be checking it out. The man, we got Chaparro right here. He came up to say what's up. But yeah, he threw that truck, the turbo truck. He threw it on billets, as you can see right there. Go check it out when I come back. But yeah, shout out to the man. If y'all need any suspension or anything done to your truck, make sure to hit him up. And it was, yeah, getting out of here. <laughs> Gave you my last, that's when you went on your bad. I ain't gonna lie, she had me sad. Now you in the past. Look at me now, your ass, doing the dance. Praying the Lord, I don't buy the stash. Running these bands. 